Hi everyone, and welcome to our channel. Today, we're going to be talking about how to make Shakeology without a blender. Shakeology is a delicious and nutritious meal replacement shake that is packed with vitamins, minerals, and antioxidants. It is a great way to start your day or fuel your workout. However, not everyone has a blender. If you don't have a blender, don't worry. There are a few simple ways to make Shakeology without one. Method 1. Using a shaker cup. A shaker cup is a great way to make Shakeology without a blender. It is simple to use and easy to clean. To make Shakeology in a shaker cup, simply add your liquid of choice, a scoop of Shakeology powder, and any other desired ingredients, such as fruit, yogurt, or nut butter. Shake vigorously until the powder is completely dissolved and the shake is smooth. Method 2 using a fork or whisk. If you don't have a shaker cup, you can use a fork or whisk to mix your Shakeology. This method may take a bit longer and require more effort, but it is still possible to make a smooth and delicious Shakeology without a blender. To make Shakeology with a fork or whisk, simply add your liquid of choice, a scoop of Shakeology powder, and any other desired ingredients to a bowl or cup. Mix vigorously until the powder is completely dissolved and the shake is smooth. Tips for making Shakeology without a blender. Here are a few tips for making Shakeology without a blender. Use warm liquid to help dissolve the powder more easily. If you are using fruit, cut it into small pieces before adding it to your Shakeology. If you are using yogurt or nut butter, add a small amount at a time and mix well before adding more. If you are having trouble dissolving the powder, try using a whisk or fork to mash it against the side of the bowl or cup. Making Shakeology without a blender is easy and simple, just follow the tips above and you'll be enjoying a delicious and nutritious Shakeology in no time. I hope this video was helpful, if you have any questions, please leave them in the comments below, thanks for watching.